Hello world, Darren Peck from Rec Revida here. So um, as you've probably seen on my one of my other videos, uh, I am in the process of traveling South America. Um, I've, I'm leaving tonight, I'm going into Colombia, uh, Bogota, and traveling through South America. Uh, I've traveled a few times and I've always used the Lonely Planet guides. So I know it's a bit old fashioned to have a printed copy um, and very rarely do I actually take these on the trip. But in terms of ease of self-referral, you can see loads and loads of bookmarks there. Um, I've always used these Lonely Planet books. Um, you don't even have to use the most up-to-date ones. Um, I know the hostels, the sort of bars, restaurants change quite regularly. But the key points and key activities and key places to go to on a travel trip are, are noted in these. So I always get my... Um, books second hand from world of books or go around charity shops things like that um obviously don't want to be buying new books if i can help it ties in with the sustainability pillar there but yeah so south america on a shoestring um by lonely planet um it's been integral in planning my tr my trip for south america um obviously i can do a lot of that information online through i've, I've combined this book also with a lot of youtube videos uh, a lot of online blogs but in terms of a single point of of information this has been sort of absolute gold mine of information so would always recommend using this as one of the first points that you use for traveling for planning any big travel trip um yeah and say you can get them sort of a couple of pound i think this was two pound from a from a charity shop so very economical way of doing it as well so and time time wise everyone's time poor so yeah get get yourself one of these if you do want to do a trip and yeah you'll save yourself a lot of time money and effort so i'm darren peck from recreator out